Uh, man, you know, it's it's that old thing, you know, perseverance, consistency, hard work, you know what I mean? Uh, my goal is to put the same work into, you know, my businesses, my family that I put into football, you know, and, and I've been running with that mantra since, you know, since I got married back in 97, you know, that if I'm going to have a successful marriage, I got to, you know, the same hard work and same consistency and discipline I had on the football field, I got to put it in my marriage and with my kids and with my, with my businesses and all that, so. Uh, it teaches you a lot, man. You know how to deal with your fellow man, and not look at his, his color, but look at you know what he can do for the overall good of what you're trying to accomplish. You know, so uh, it, you know, sports to me in general is just an incredible deal. When you, you talk about football specifically, because of the closeness of guys, I, I just believe it's an amazing sport. Welcome to footballgameplan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook here at the Giants Minicamp 2017 with Travaris King, outstanding wide receiver. And one thing that was impressive about your game, you had the big catch in the playoff game. And I, I was sitting there watching like, okay, great, because I've seen hard work pay off. You worked really hard out here. You got the opportunity, and you capitalized. What work were you putting in to help you get to that point where you are able to contribute in the playoff game? Just a lot, man. Um, a lot of stuff behind the scenes, um, on the scene. Just, um, just a lot of, a lot of hard work, man. Um, everybody in our room works extremely hard. Um, we push each other, and um, you know that's kind of what we harp, harp on is uh, pushing each other, making each other better. And one thing that was impressive, let's say last training camp, I noticed as every practice went on, it, one day you're, you're just making catches with your hands. Next day you're starting to, you know, sacrifice your body, diving for footballs, and. It was one practice in particular, I think it was down on this end, where you really extended and caught a bunch of deep balls. And I was like, this guy is really showing out, showing up and showing out, you know. So when you're a receiver and your success is tied to what the guy throwing you the football can do, how do you work out and work on your game to get better to where you're improving every day? Well, the main thing is the main thing. You got to be exactly where, you know, uh, Eli and, and the quarterbacks want you to be. So finding that consistency with them is huge. And then staying consistent is the hardest part. So um, just finding that consistency with them, finding the consistency with yourself. And final question, looking back on your short career, going back to when you were at Georgia, what would you say you've picked up and what have you learned from, from your freshman year to now? Man, uh, so much. You know, I've been around so many great players, um, so many great receivers. Um, guys in my room now, O, B, Mar, Shep, um, the Georgia with A.J. Green, Muhammad Masipal. I've just been around so many great receivers that I've taken tidbits of their game and, and their minds and implemented them into mine and, and the things that I can do. I definitely wish you the best of luck moving forward. Good luck, minicamp, and throughout the rest of the preseason. Right, man, I appreciate it.